So we're starting on Yoshi's. I think this might be just a neutral pick in this matchup. Uh, she's gonna just try to find needles and split up Icy's. Well, Icy's are obviously looking for the grab, and that'll be the first wobble from Diplomatic Toucan. If he doesn't drop it, obviously, I, I mean, Ice Climbers having the wobble, a infinite, that if they get the grab and hit it at 200 BPM, get a kill. Assuming they do not drop it. But, uh, Sheik has the tools to obviously just split up Nana, but uh, Toucan is really good at uh, saving Nana, but it looks like Nana's dead. And uh, this is where the matchup comes easier for Sheik, as long as she gets the kill. But uh, Diplomatic Toucan, known for having a pretty good solo Popo and Sopo. Not, uh, not a bad player by any means, and not the character definitely does not should underestimate, underestimate. Uh, Wobbles once said, you treat the Ice Climbers as a bad character, but you treat, uh, you treat Popo as a good character. Because as soon as you kill Nana, you, uh, you kind of unlock the Dash Dance, which, uh, you know, obviously Popo is a worse character, but that doesn't mean that he's just a straight up terrible character. He's a low tier character, but you shouldn't underestimate the player, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, Shield Drop, uh, Fair gets hit by Down Throw Downer, but SDI's out. Very nice showing from Iron Piggy. Uh, just kind of, oh, wave land on the platform, just not, I think he drops the wobble and saves Nana. Diplomatic Toucan, up a considerable amount. Yeah, I don't really know this matchup, but, all I do know is that, <laughs> um, I've just heard it's tough for shoot. I can't vouch. Oh, unfortunate SD. So yeah, I mean, Toucan's still up. It's not a big deal, per se, but, you know, obviously you don't want to see that in uh, winner's round two of top eight. She's just kind of throwing out tilts, up airs, kills Nana, nice job. And uh, now, back to Sopo versus Sheik. I think uh, Sopo has a chain grab on Sheik. Sheik has a chain grab on Sopo. And st I th I th either Sheik doesn't have a chain grab on Sopo, or they both have chain grabs on each other. I am, it's, it's one of those two. But uh, obviously Sheik's grab game, very good. Able to tech chase fundamentally. Oh wow, impressive. I'm not sure if that was an accident or a read. Either way, it's last stock here on Yoshi Story. Okay, yeah, that's that's what I thought. Uh, I know Sopo. Yeah, that. Yeah, okay. Thank you. It's. I. I thought it was one or the other. Okay. She, uh, she still has a good grab. So they're going to go to Battlefield. She uh, can take advantage of the platforms here with her shield drops. Uh, very good stage for her. As long as the Sheik is able to consistently hit the, uh, their shield drop, hit their shield drops. But uh, that'll be the first stock, probably. Unless, uh, oh wow, nice recovery. As long as Toucan doesn't drop this, that'll be the first stock. Yeah, okay, and a zero to death from Toucan, not even needing a wobble. Uh, just kind of winning neutral, not necessarily messing up, and uh, overall just showing that he knows what he's doing. I mean, he didn't. It's not like it's it's uh, easy to beat NMW. Okay, and uh, Nana is dead unless two K. Oh, nice save. Wait, no, I think Nana would have made it back anyway. Uh, my bad. 
Okay, ooh, uh, misses the affair. That would have split the ICs up, and that would have been to let give him the chance to. Uh, ooh, oh no. Well, okay, so he was at a high percent, and my my suspicion is that he wanted to either just go for it and save Nana, or he knew he was gonna die soon anyway. Which was, uh, if he saved Nana, then that would have been great. He would have been able to either get, have potential for, you know, the wobble. Anyway, so three stocks apiece. Right, Toucan finds the grab, and that'll be a... Oh, oh, he drops the wobble. Um, back air. That'll, uh... They're talking about something. It looks like... Yeah, okay. No, I'm, that's not. I was saying uh, he wanted. He would. He would have rather have saved Nana than and lost the or tried to save Nana and lost the stock. Uh, than you know, just playing Sopo at 100%. Uh, but uh, okay. So solid, solid stuff from Iron Piggy getting the kill. Quick, uh, quick evening it up, resetting it here. Uh, uh, throws the needles, but he gets, uh, even though it has an absurd shield stun, he finds the grab. Oh, wow, great fair for 2 game. Okay. Okay. Good to know. Not a matchup I know very well. I'm just kind of uh, making educated guesses based on just like the decisions our players are making. Um, so Iron Piggy needs to find this Nana kill, or you know some sort of gimp like that. That'll that'll be uh, and that'll be the stock. Yeah, that's that's one way to do it. But now we have a last stock situation. Can Iron Piggy find this kill on Nana and take the game, perhaps? Or will Toucan just, you know, find what, find his, uh, footing? Oh, wow. Oh, and, uh, Nana gets hit by the, the poof, Cheeks Up E. And, uh, doesn't look like it's gonna matter. But, uh, good recovery from Sheik going to the platform, knowing that it's harder for the Ice and Ice Climbers to cover that. Or can't specifically like get a wobble off of it, but that'll be a down smash, and that'll be it. Um, Toucan will take a 2-0 over Iron Pig. So yeah, so, you know, good stuff to Toucan. We'll see Iron Piggy in the losers bracket. Looks like we have Treble versus NMW coming up. Falco 